ready? Yes. something like you win this time. Okay. So now you're trying to squeak me. Is that correct? And remember, it's touch and move, not those games you play. I play the real chess moves. Okay. So it's touch and move this game. Okay, thank you for telling me. Okay. Oh, yeah, so now what are you going to do? Everything. Nothing. Everything. Just trading around, touching. Yeah, let's just trade. Let's trade. So much for your snipers. Yeah. Let's try to castle. Already in endgame. Nice. I don't really like endgame because it's simple. What do you want? Know? Why do you want endgame? You don't know what, how to play an endgame. I do know how to play. No, you don't. I said no. I said no. I said thank you. Oh, that is a nice. That is very nice. See, the is mad. You ruined my record. What's your name? Uh, you know your pawn's pin, right? You know your queen's pin, right? My queen's not pin. I picked it up. Like Mickey Mouse, but not without a mouse. Who's playing? He won. He already beat me. I gotta take it. I have no choice. Me too. No choice. I can't. I can't connect those pawns. Huh? Okay, I'm not connecting those pawns. Not connecting them. You're going to sleep. What do you think of that? I don't care. I'm gonna, not gonna, I'm gonna go to sleep. My pawn. That's After mine. You? Give me that pawn. Give me that pawn. That's huh? my pawn. Mine all day long. That fun? Okay. Okay, yes, I just don't want my rook to be in danger. Every time you make a good move, you can help me. You want to go? Okay, I'll do that. What are you going to do? Oh, I thought you meant this one. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm my dad. Scoot over here. Just gonna scoot. Just gonna scoot. Just gonna scoot over yeah. here. Offer you draw there. Want to draw? You gonna draw as far? I ain't gonna go here. Go ahead. I'm gonna put the rook down here next. I did that. Okay. Thank you. Take your pawn. You want to do that? Huh? Just say no. Okay. All right, I'll do that. No. What's wrong? My rook's in danger. I didn't say it wouldn't be in danger. That's what happens when you play with the big boys. What do you want me to tell you? Who said you're a big boy? Well, I think your sister, who I beat, both of them. Wait. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, that. Oh, shoot. Oh, shooty, Kalama. What? Shooty Kalami. He's being squeaked. Kalami? Yes? Don't be a salami now. I, I put my nickname, but I am Gulani Salami. Whoa! Hey, I'm Gulani Salami. See how my king and queen are switched? No, I'm not all paying. All opening theory is gone. I'm only paying attention to her. All, all the opening theory is gone. All the preparation is gone. And now we just... No! Wait. No! Yeah, really? No, uh, no preparation theory. Whoa. Oh, There's some training. Guy has a, yeah, a knack for... Uh, a knackiness. He has a knackiness. Nice check, Mike. No, he has a knack for knackiness. You understand? I... Got him. No. He doesn't got that. 
That's not the board, actually. That's not the same. Man, that's not the way the game's played. It is the way the game's played. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. You said no. Looks like a draw. Well, you already did no, 58 not, moves. You did 58 draw. moves. That's it. No, that's not 58. That's 35? Beautiful, Mike. You've done it again. Let's go. Let's go for it. That doesn't do anything. I go there, check. So what? Uh, that's what. You're in check. So, uh, Golomnikov! No, 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 no. Golomnikov! No. Golomnikov! <laughs> you didn't you, you hit the clock? Uh. Tell him. Somebody please Wait, tell me. actually, you didn't hit the clock. I hit it. Yeah, now I hit the clock. That's all your times when I checked. You took your king and didn't hit the clock. Uh, okay. Now, if you want to play okay, again. Okay. Want to play again? It looks like you guys are what? shaking. Oh, I mean, you know, shaking with terror or something. <laughs> they were petrified. Petrified? I mean, yeah. Oh, man, that'll do it to you. <laughs> you want to play again? Good. You're good. You're, let's play again. He's good for what? But I better win or else we'll never talk again. Yeah. No, I'm not. Yes, you is. No, I ain't. Yes, you be. No. Hush up. What? Hush up. Texas, Texas is trying to play, man. What are you talking about? I'm talking about Tex. You're messing with the conversation. I'm talking Tex, textile. Tex who? Tex, you know who. Touch your move. Go ahead. Ain't no touch your move. Ain't no I don't know, I don't know what your problem is. So ain't. You're going to be a nice one. Nice right. oh. boy. <laughs> Adjust. Oh, yeah, you're going to be a nice one. Keep on pushing. No. You know what? Ha. Let's go, Carl. Give me a shit. I got next monkey with a long tail. Get out of here. Don't you even think about it. Don't you even dream what? about it. Look how he runs. Run, Force. How'd you think he was going to run? Run, Force. Well, I ain't gonna do no good, so I'm about to do this, sir. That goes there. And powerful, very powerful. <laughs> that goes there. You talking about my game? What? Just compensation. You talking about your game? Mm. But I lied. Yes. And Get up. Now. Get up. Get up and do what? Get games over. I don't, I don't understand. I'm All gonna right. show you right now. Take it and I'll show you what happens. I'll rip your head right off your shoulders. That That's right. Did you hear what he said? It's not about he shoulders, knows. head. It's what, five moves and the game's over? That's what you got to do. That's and watch this, check. Yes. Watch this. Watch no. what happens now. Haga. Haga. Check. No. I told you what going to happen the way you want wow. to happen. Shut up. You're the best. That's not a mate. That's a mate. That's a mate. See you later. What did you guys just thought? So did we, but the game's over. Hey, things happen. That was wow. brutal. Hey, Why are you that good? Please, please. You're not that please. good. Please. Play, right. play like doing? somebody lays up. <laughs> Hey guys, Brian here in a beautiful attack by Boston Mike on the semi-open B-file, man. And this was, look at this, with the bishop sack opening up black's position and ends with the beautiful mate. Look at that, queen and the rook. Wow. And to give, to give you guys some context, it went. this was the inflection point. It went from 0.8 to 7.1, so really big jump. So we'll definitely go over in the analysis where the... Uh, where, where the defense should have been for big techs in this position so a great game by mike in the second game and a classic check hustle <laughs> move at the end of the first game as well man if you guys want to get boston mike coffee his link is in the video description and um i always forget to tell you guys he always tells me to tell you guys that if you guys send him coffee then please write down a note to him it could be about anything he loves reading the notes and uh, he really gets a kick out of them and um, so definitely be sure to include any notes if you guys send me coffee. And yeah, let's go over uh, the analysis. What what Black should have done, um, what Tech should have done in this position. And we'll go over the first game as well, how, how Golan could have closed it out. So here, uh, let's go move back. Instead of F6, we'll be another move for Black here. Yes, you know that White's going to double up. So tuck the King in the corner and then Rook over and now... White's attack is a bit refuted now. It's going to take him some time to come up with another attack, but that could have been one way to go. 
All right, let's go here in this position and Golan failing to see the check at the end saw the glorious checkmate sequence here and but of course uh, <laughs> oh man it's like Napoleon says man the the most dangerous moment comes before victory and that other world champion said the hardest game to win is a one game so but the million dollar question is how Golan could have um, closed it out and Oh, before I do that, I just want to point out a really nice uh, tactic here by Golan. Double attack right here and able to pick up the exchange. So that was very, very nicely done by Golan. And going over here in the game, King E7 was played. Let's go move back. Will be another move for black here. What, what's the, what should the strategy be? And this is a fun one. So let's see if you guys can find it. All right, I call this the torture strategy. And, and the... <laughs> The idea is you want to obviously cut the king off, keep one of the rooks on the 7th rank, but feel free to um, start gobbling up. But not only that, to renew the threat of mate. So rook is attacking the knight, knight b5, rook takes, and now you're threatening the mate that Golan was looking for this entire time on the other side. So rook defends, and now these two pieces are kind of tied down. These two pawns are under a threat. Only white can do is jump around with his knight hope, hoping for a fork and uh, it looks like he may have one here but of course he can get the rooks out with a check and um, renew the threat here a bit but uh, kind of keep keep one of the rooks on the seventh to to seal the king in and now just the knight's gonna start hopping trying to get some counterplay but no dice and Black is going to start rolling these pawns, and you'll see what Black is going to do here with that F pawn, F3. And now, I know it's um, white to move, but if it's black to move, what would you play here? Why is that pawn move so devastating? Yes, rook check. So now this rook is defended by this pawn, and... Um, king must come over and then you have mate here and pawn guarding the escape square so at this point white can only delay the inevitable by checking like crazy but um boom 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 there it is that's the checkmate so yeah it's it's a uh, yeah golan was looking for the mate but it's a little bit um gotta employ the torture strategy to <laughs> start cleaning up and renew the threat and and utilize your other uh well pawns technically are not pieces but use your other material to help aid you in the mate but uh, it was there it just required a little bit of finessing and I think just Golan saw victory in his eyes and forgot the sneaky check by Mike there at the end man it's, it's really funny because Mike always gets hustled by the kids so <laughs> it's uh it's just uh, to see the flip the script flipped you know it's like it's pretty funny so but great game played by Golan just uh just the hardest game to win is one game man and the most dangerous moment comes before victory. Uh, I think as he plays more, he'll understand that. And because uh, that's a very, very common theme in all the coffee chess games, man. So, all right. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you the game in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification. And thanks. I'll see you guys tomorrow.